right, thank you, Armin. It's Collison and Warwick to get the championship game underway. Both tried to steal the tap. Warwick got the advantage. Billy, I would think the pace in this game is so critical, more than most that you see. Well, here's what we're going to see early on, and certainly Duke Ford immediately took up the slack. We're looking at one of the really great freshman players who knows how to play the game in Oklahoma, and they shut them down with the same strategy. Sounds like Heinrich will meet, need a big night here. Absolutely. Him. He has got to be the one of those perimeter shooters to get hot. First of the night, air ball, but Collis remarkably their fourth Big 12 opponent coming here. Be ready if they could win this game to maybe want that Big 12 championship title back in our side. Well, Anthony comes in after the shortness. Yes, they could be the Big 12 champs and the national champs. The Syracuse wins tonight. Anthony looks like he's going to take it to him and stand outside. A match in, in that Arizona regional final that was a good one. Now, what this defense does, it really takes away from Lankford's ability to slash inside. There he goes inside and makes it anyway. Six foot four. He started on Saturday with 23 against Marquette. Only missed three shots from the field and 14 attempts. Second best first half he had in the year. Arizona being the other. Good backdoor cut by Anthony. Dwayne is in the He's telling his team to settle down over there in the sideline. They're trying to go for home runs instead of attacking that zone. Take Notice Anthony setting up down inside the lane. Outside three. Oh, how pure. And what Langford's going to have to understand, let Anthony uses his head and his eyes to look you down and then prepares that jumper. Beautiful pass. Graves so quickly inside the Collison. Down inside, an excellent maneuver here. Right over force outstretch hands. Collison, a great finish. I think of all the outstanding players, legendary names who went through the Kansas program, and Collison second. McNamara feeling his pressure. Anthony on the baseline, looking to shrug off Langford again. <laughs> they, Roy Williams was right. That was a double dribble. He got by. He making put the ball on the floor. He can't back off and give up that easy jump shot. Collison stutter step and drive. Soft touch. Worth likes to stand in there and just occupy space. Warwick, season open lane. Adams, two for Warwick. And St. Collison should have stayed on at Syracuse. Hakeem Warwick, 18 against Texas. And in Langford and in Miles, they have two players this year that are averaging 27% between them from three point. A hold off by Collison. Collison with the strong. He'll end the game, another. Strong freshman here at Syracuse. And there's the ballet dancer. Wallison really has the soft hands in the crowd. Four turnovers for the Jayhawks here in the early going. McNamara, three, again. And there's Anthony. He throws Lee on the play. Lee tried to go ahead and help out. Too late. That matches the largest deficit of the entire tournament for Kansas. Eight. Langford, though, slices it to sit off. And that's against a, a zone that's letting him take the outside shot. Look at this shot. Man. Oh, oh, my goodness. No, no Jim, because I've seen him do this throughout the course of the year. As a matter of fact, in this tournament as well, Oklahoma obviously has a lot more attempts in his a 43% career three-point shooter. At least over 50% on the season. Work in the paint. They're going to count the basket and set him to I really think early in this ball game, this is where he can be so effective. And if you're a Kansas fan, Billy, the man you always hold your breath with as far as foul trouble, Graves has picked up his second here, seven and a half minutes into the game. Talked about him early, and some of the key Williams' bench is so short, and when Graves gets it for block. Anthony Heinrich on him. Finds the open man, Edelman. Kansas trying to get the break, but look at who's waiting on him. Sip. I think, I think we're going to see Gary having to go out of this. That's Edelin. Beautiful work. Miles and Lankford going out of there now. That will not get it done. Anthony read the inbound. Three on one and up the pace for the two. Miles. But look at Syracuse again. Back down the floor. Heinrich at last. Heinrich is going to have to come up huge if they're going to come back. Will the first be the start of something? Anthony shut down this time, gets it right back. See where he gets it back in a little closer, and that's got to go and find an open spot. 
Again, trying to go inside out. Heinrich, two straight perhaps. Yes, good looking foul. The running Jayhawks of Saturday. Now, why did Syracuse pull this out? Kansas went through a 1 3 1 zone, something that Arizona did so effectively against them. Collison's running the baseline. Mel oh. here again. That eliminates the point zone a little bit. Nothing wrong with those wrists. Miles quickly at the other. Graves waits, gets it. Now, why another cheap foul? Syracuse, the team that plays his own, now has to play against his own. Anthony, wow. The floor right now, Heinrich is the only pure shooter that Kansas has. Good passing here, Graves. Thomason on the follow. They just have not been able to extend the floor with their perimeter game. Well, the inside games work well. Absolutely. McNamara. Oh. oh. This Scranton freshman is a scrapper. Put up high, tipped up by Graves. Can't, the problem is he hasn't been able to stop Syracuse no matter what the defense. He went to the 1 3 1, now he's back to man to man. Blaney stepped in, two. No call. Blaney with a three. Nifty oh, pass, oh, oh, two. Oh. He needs to get back in concentration, but what a night he's having. He's got his 10, Billy. You talked about Dwayne and double figures. Do that in any game this year. Tremendous first half on their part. Like the one they had, he was pleased with it. He said they would skip past Miles, 25% shooter from three. But yeah. you're skip passing over to a person that doesn't want to take the jump shot. Against Connecticut, he was just two for 10 when they lost in the first. Langford, front end, back end. Of of that defensive balance of this terrific zone. Langford tries his first three of the night. And Graves at the putback. We always think about Kentucky, how great they were. Massachusetts was the highest seeded team coming in there. Highest rated, number one in the country. McCambi. Langford this time for a three point play to shave it to seven. A calming effect here. Hey, here. Anthony with the ball. Yeah. This is pretty calming, too. McNamara with another three. Graves. Quick release, Heinrich. McNamara. Challenged again. And that's the first easy toss. Comes out with it. On the wing, Langford, and ooh! Oh, man, Anthony drags him down. But he did hold him on the way down. Nice sportsmanship that time by Carmelo Anthony. How quick was that? Well, you know you've really hit him hard, and now you have also. Uh, he was going for ball to start off with there. I think that is really good sportsmanship no, on his part. No question. He was going for the block, and then he realized that he could get in trouble and help go right down to the floor with him. Nice job. First, first on Anthony. Hold on, they're going to call that. Flagrant foul, Billy? Oh, I don't think so. They're calling it intentional. Intentional foul. I, I don't buy it at all. I think initially Carmelo Anthony was going up for the block, and then the. I don't know if the players realize this, but they should go and try to steal. Down to 10 on the shot clock, seven second differential. Anthony over Collison this time. Oh, that give, go out and try to make a steal. Heinrich with five, Collison reverse. Nice move. So we have reached halftime in the Superdome in Syracuse behind Jerry McNamara's 18, six three-pointers for the mayor of Scranton. And Syracuse leads it, will continue from the Houston. Two misfires at the line. Kansas, eight out of 15 tonight, shooting threes. McNamara, two-point shot. Anthony with the tip. Heinrich gunning. And Miles gets to the spot in time. Looking for help, finds Langford. Downs and lead, takes it for Kansas. Here he is, jumper three. Yes, right off the B again. Lee did a great job of defending. And there's Heinrich, no call. Collison put back, six point. The play by Warwick. Now here, Jim, is where we talk about seniors and freshmen. The freshmen had their way in the beginning of this game. Now the experienced seniors give them some problems. Another steal. Up ahead is Miles. Heinrich the trailer. Heinrich in over Dwayne. Which way are they calling it? This time it's a block. Count the basket. Jimmy here now. Third call against Warwick. The basket counts. Heinrich will go to the line to bring it the three. Dave 
at Briarcliff College. Can you imagine coaching two fathers that became coaches? Allison secures it. Edel and Lee reach it in. And that's going right back to McNamara. Quick pass to Anthony. Allison. Now Anthony to shoot two. Eastern Regionals, both Juan Dixon before the Final Four. Juan told him to have a career. Seems like this entire tournament, that's been a story of families traveling. Great pass. He was caught for a moment. Collison only attempted one three in this half and misfired after knocking down ten in the first. And pace. He loves that shot. Jalen Rose. That's the Jalen Rose. Move. That's his man. man. Langford's man. Yep. And inside race caught underneath. Gets it back. Banks have made out of foul trouble in this second half. Warren. Yeah. Oh, wow. How about some semi numbers? Miles got the spin on it. And Graves led that one up ahead. Tough pass. Graves. That's twice now, Graves yeah. made suspect passes. Anthony, big three. Well, this is a story now developing. Kansas has missed nine of its last 11 from the line. Kansas only shoots 66% as a team. Pace got loose. Heinrich is ready to come in at the scorer's table. Anthony on the drive and the give up Edelin. Ooh, off the front of the rim. Story high school pro play. Yep. All comes from the feet. Bad play. It's into the floor. And a few smart. We really felt though they were going to get all the way back. Yeah. They never did. Again, Miles reluctant to take the outside jumper. Nice pass inside. It's awful strong though. He's a good leaper. He did a great job defensively in that Duke game in the Sweet 16. Edelin. Allison with only two points in the second half. Pace, turn around, blocked by Heinrich. Now you know how Jason Gardner felt, huh? Perfect block by him. Edelin rattles out fourth with an outside Heinrich. Short again. Graves, put back, huge. Before Kansas can have two on offense. Kansas had another comeback run. And there's the start. Stutter step, Langford runs into Collison. Loose ball to Edelin. Uh-oh. Hold on a minute here. It's going to be thought would be a walk. Instead, it's going to be a foul on Langford. A huge call. And that is number five on number five. That is a huge call. There was body contact. But really, I thought Edelin was going down anyway. This is a huge call. And I don't know if Kansas can recover without the rest of them giving up that much size. One and one here for Edelin. And Sir. The line, 317 more than the keywords he got sports line. Pace makes the move past Lee. Drives home two. They do look very tired on this possession. Yep. Reach in McNamara. It can have an effect. Frankford out. Really hurts him. Oh. Drive. Miles plucks it out of the air. Syracuse back. Heinrich, though, wants to drive. Reach in, Edelin. Scoop, Collison. Down to Nallison. Coach Beheim wanted as many of the players as possible from that 87 team to be here tonight to try to be a part of this if it isn't back to championship night. Heinrich launching three. You. Anthony saw what was going to happen to him, but he was suckered inside on the penetration. It's Heinrich's first basket since turning the ankle. Wide open for it. Oh, no, Collison, be careful. He had this is just a great play inside by Warren. Fourth makes the catch, and that is his third basket of the night. Jim, after going in this particular... Minutes left. So you can see what Kansas strategy. They're going to half-court zone trap. Solid with that one. 40 on the clock. Heinrich left alone inside. Seven on the shot clock. As we approach two minutes, Edelin up and in. That was a huge play because Kansas had the clock in their favor. Big possession for Syracuse. Low oh! inside, Collison. These seniors not letting go of the dream. Collison with the rebound. Heinrich was open on the side. Lee got it. Down to three. We'll need to go there now, I guess. You can go for two, get that ball down inside, let Collison touch it. There he is. Step to the basket, kick back outside. Miles for the three. Front of the rim, tipped up. Oh, Graves gets it back. And he'll head back to the line. Free throw. 
It looked pretty good. Not be any problem getting the ball right to him. Oh, Graves hits the floor. Warwick and Dwayne will be the man. 24 seconds. Three-point game. Kansas has a shot. Miles to the right side. Heinrich to the top of the key. Heinrich with four seconds. Gives it up corner. Lee shot blocked. They have less than a second to go. It's not how tall, it's how long, and Warwick got a piece of that. It's actually showing no time on the clock, but seven-tenths of a second on the shot clock. So no, there's seven-tenths on the game clock. And Heinrich, I thought he would launch it. Lee instead. Seven-tenths of a second. I, I really thought Heinrich probably should have taken it, but you know, Lee's a, the best... For, shooter they have percentage wise but it's just the fact that Warwick with those long arms was able to pick it off they're going to review now to see if there's a need to add any tenths to the clock check it out Lee got exactly the shot if you're Kansas you'd like him to take but look at Warwick with those long arms at what point do you say it crossed out well, they've got to add some time. underneath the basket let it go there but Heinrich and Lee are the two guys. Heinrich starts inside, goes outside. Heinrich gets it. Heinrich puts up the shot. It's too long, and Syracuse is your national champion. Has New Orleans given us Final Fours or not?